Hello, so we're in uh, Chapel Street today in Aberamen and this is a lovely newish style. I think, I'll have to double check, but I think it's about 30 years old. It might even be less than that. So, it's really nice. <laughs> it's a beautiful two double bedroom, newish style home. So I'll just do a little street view. So it's nice, you're tucked up, you've got a pharmacist just at the bottom. This is like the main road through Aberamen, but still it's lovely because you're just tucked up. So you've got houses across the road which have the driveways. Through here is where I think, would be, well it is, you have got the parking, but I personally think that this is another added bonus. Though you can see I parked out on the main road, there's no need for it. <laughs> because there's your side access for you to go in. And here is all the allocated parking. So as you can see, parking for the houses up here, and then you've got a row over here as well. So yeah, I really like this. Okay, I know you haven't got a driveway right outside your house like the other ones, but does it matter? <laughs> I actually think this is nicer. Your car's really tucked away by there. So you've got the side access to come in with all your shopping. But if you're lazy like me, <laughs> you can just park outside. Because as you can see, lots of people do. And it's a really nice, really nice, quiet, wide street. So right, let's go in. I really like this. I've been in, I've turned all the lights on. I'm well prepared. <laughs> but it smells like the most amazing man's aftershave in here. This is gorgeous. So lovely laminate flooring. You've got a really nice, really well conditioned. I don't know if it's brand new, but the, you can see the letterbox. It's still got a sticky back plastic. So let's go in, shut the door. So again, it depends if you want to come in through the back door, if you were parking around the back. Lovely modern doors, all done in the gloss white. You come straight in. Here's your living room. So I'm not going to say that this is the biggest house in the world, but for what it is, this is a gorgeous two-bed home, which has plenty of space. Look at that. Again, all the laminate is in really good condition. I think it may be brand new. I know the carpet's throughout are brand new. It's had all a brand new repaint throughout. You've got a big window to the front. I think, to be honest, all the PVC is near enough brand new, but I will double check that. If it's not, it's in a beautiful condition. Look at that. I like the warmer tones of the cream with the grey. I just really think it makes them a little bit more warmer. So yeah, look at that. It's lovely. You've got your thermostat on the wall there. I like to do the landing. You've got two, two lights in here. And then look at these. No, I love, I love the glass doors. I think they do a fantastic job of throwing light around this place. So, into your kitchen diner, because you'd have enough space to put a little table and chairs here. You've got a larger unit. Now, I'm not going to say he, that this is a brand new kitchen. It's not, but it's been cleaned to an inch of its life <laughs> and is in immaculate condition. So there is no need to change it at all. As you can see, all the walls are in really good condition. They are painted cream, but they are perfectly done. There's a utility space out there. So you've got space for a washing machine, but then you've got it all out there. So I'd say dishwasher. There's your boiler. It's a relatively new, it's a combi boiler. You would need to put a, um, you know, a freestanding cooker in. And then another space for there. So I don't know. <laughs> you could have an extra, I don't know, you could have tumble. I don't really know what you'd want to put there, to be honest. I think it's fantastic that it's got space because your fridge freezer could go right by the door and you still have enough space to do this, the light switch. But look at that. I think it's fantastic. A beautiful, beautiful kitchen in super good condition. And then I love that you've got this utility space. Because like I said, well, it makes your kitchen have tons of storage. Because look at this. Ah, oh, hide my washing baskets. <laughs> Keep my ironing board out here. See, you've got space for your washing machine there. Possibly washing machine, tumble, dishwasher. And then you've got a little space there, maybe for a slimline something or other. But yeah, look at this, it's fantastic. 
I really love that it's got this utility space. You now, if you've got an animal, if you've got a dog, you've been out walking, come in through the back. He can cut you out here. Or the cats can live out here. I don't know. It's just better to have a utility space. So here's the garden. Lovely patchwork garden. Tiny, tiny little bit of grass. But it depends what you're into again. You could artificial it if you want to. But yeah, it's fantastic. It's a lovely, quiet location. I'm going to stand over here so you can have a really good look. So there's the side entrance that you'd come into. Look at that. It's actually a really good size home with a good size garden. It's fantastic. I'm going to stand down here, give you another, another view of the garden. Look how good that is. Honestly, this is a fabulous starter home, family home. Um, you could be like a couple with a one child. You could be looking for your first home. You could be, uh, you know, a single person with one child or just a single person in general. You could be retiring a couple in, the, you know, so yes, <laughs> I really do think this is a lovely, lovely home. So right, let's go up. I love these doors. Again, it gives it that modern feeling. I think they're from Howden's. <laughs> I do see them an awful lot. So you can still smell the new carpet. It's lovely and puffy as well. I can feel it under my feet. So great carpet. You've got all matching doors up here as well to match the one as you come in through the porch. So that's really nice. We'll go do the master. So here's the master bedroom. It's slightly bigger than the back bedroom. And obviously it's at the front, so it's really nice. You've got a big window. Look at that, it's a fabulous space. I'll open this for you. Storage with your tank, your hot water tank. I love, I'm gonna step back so you can see this. You've got an alcove space, so perfect for wardrobes. And then you've got all of that space. Beautiful. <laughs> and again, look at the view then out here. It's just really nice. And you can tell, yeah, the windows are in immaculate condition. All the window sills. Ah, oh, it's so, it's, it's, it's immaculate here. Again, cream with the grey carpet. It's lovely, it's a beautiful size double. Into the bathroom. So family bathroom upstairs. It's not the newest again, but it's so super. It's clean, it's in amazing condition. There is no need, plus I'm a massive fan in thinking <laughs> coloured bathrooms are on their way back. I'm telling you now. So you've got, I'll lift this out the way for you. So there we go. You've got your shower off the bath. Grey walls. It is painted grey in here. And it's a grey suite. So, you know, it's all the rage. <laughs> so look at that. Again, new window. Throwing in loads of light. It's lovely. It's a really nice space. And then the second bedroom. Let's go in. Go stand over here. Give you a really good idea. Yeah, it's fab. As you can see, another really good double. You could have a double out this way and then wardrobes over here. So yeah, do I really like this? It's a beautiful home. I just think if you want something that needs absolutely no work at all, it's under a hundred thousand pound. The lady is open to offers. I believe at this moment it's on for 92,000. So the lady is open to offers again on that. So yeah. What more do you want? It's really nice. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Bye.